especially like social media our oh, fucking phones fucking it's yeah. like do i need to fucking mindlessly scroll and like go down doom scrolling and now just feeling worse about myself as i scroll down my fucking instagram feed do you get that feeling oh yeah what? everybody does how do you get that feeling i like? mean everyone i think everyone feels like they could either be doing more or be more or sure. be better in whatever fucking way. I can see that. And I think there's constantly, no matter who you are and what you're built like, there's well, the comparison. Well, here's the issue, thing. and this is one of my favorite quotes, and I should know who quoted this. Jeremy, you're going to have to look this up. But comparison is the thief of joy. Oh, 100%. Right? And that's... Um, I know you've done some other someone. podcasts and stuff like that, but for me to be genuine, I don't go and listen to any of those. I just... I don't know how... Many times I've had a guest in here, and honestly, having my own podcast has ruined pot me listening to podcasts really? because it makes you compare. Well, you can't help but that, and also I get labeled sometimes as like not being authentic, and I still get labeled like really? that. Like, That's oh, just... you're just saying what so and so did. Well, it's, there's like, also a million fucking podcasts yeah. out there. So, like, it's Theodore Roosevelt. But you know, when you hear something. Teddy, oh, Teddy Roosevelt. I love Teddy. Teddy. Yeah. He is the fucking goat. See, not, He's the best. Have you ever seen him as a teenager? No. no. Hold on let's a second. See I got that. I got it. I always I love showing people that. Fuck yeah, let's go, Hold Jeremy. On a second, watch this. This is t Teddy Roosevelt is Chris's favorite historical figure yes. of all time. Probably didn't one he of do mine like too. bare knuckle fights in front of like the White House lawn? He did all kinds of badass shit. I wouldn't doubt it, but this is what an eighteen year old used to look like. <laughs> A man. <laughs> God damn, that's bad. Dude, are you ass, joking? Dude. Look at this. He's dude. fucking hard. <laughs> He's just wow. Yeah. Nine. I'm sorry. Nineteen years old. Oh, he was a awesome. wrestler and a boxer. I fucking love it. Yeah, he'd spar with younger fucking White House stud. guards. I love that. And yeah, he was. He was. He was an OG. I'm not a real historian. Chris has educated me on Teddy Roosevelt. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, who? Oh, what? When? He's cool. He's getting a. He's getting a bad. Uh... A bad rap right now. Really? Chris is in Dublin. Who Teddy is? Yeah. Oh, why? Well, why are you coming for well, Teddy, guys? Does. Dude, Leave who, Teddy alone. Who isn't in fucking history, man? They're Literally. all fucked, man. Like, it, it was a different world back then. We cannot yeah. hold these people in our history that built our country to the same standards as we live in today. Totally. Like, there's no fucking way you can't. Uh, what do they call it? It's not shadow banning, but what do you call it? What dead name? It's not dead naming. But cancel dead culture. Naming. Cancer culture. Like yeah. historical figures. Exactly. Like, this is like, so out this of This is hand. an important. I feel like history is an important uh, roadmap to see how we got to where we're at now. Totally. This is kind like of how I feel it. when I wake up in the morning. <laughs> it, it, like, uh, most uh, most of the time, like that's kind of how I sit through most of the day. Like just going online, Damn, dude. Uh, it's me. It's my he's, he's just like spread eagle. I guarantee <laughs> about how to him at nineteen would whoop most. The art of manliness. I love that. He That's... would probably whoops most men's asses <clears throat> today, dude. We have gotten so soft. Soft. So soft. Soft. Yeah.